Hello and welcome to the introduction to the Horticulture Apprenticeship with Keats. We have Louise from the Business Development team who's going to tell us a little bit more about this qualification. So tell us Louise, what makes up the Horticulture Apprenticeship? Okay, the Horticulture Apprenticeship is made up of three main components. So you've got your diploma, you've got your functional skills and the knowledge component which is called the technical certificate. You've also got certificate of competence which is required for horticulture as well. And how long do these qualifications usually take, Louise? It can be anywhere between 12 months and 16 months, depending on your age and the stage, the level that you're working at. So in that time, how often will the assessors be visiting and where, where do the visits take place? Okay, your assessor, it's all work-based, so your assessor will come to your work and visit you. There's no need to go out to college or anything like that. Um, and they'll be about once a month. Okay. Um, and with regards to funding, how does it work with the funding? How does the qualification get funded for these students? Okay, so it's all government funded. Um, it's completely funded for 16 to 18 year olds. There is a small contribution required for 19 years old plus, um, which is required from the employer, but it's very, very small in the scheme of things, considering how much the whole qualification costs. And we can give you more information on that if you give us a call. Um, the rest of it is completely funded and we also have, as I said before, we've had, we have access to some government grants as well which can help. Um, what sort of um, work will these apprentices be doing? So what sort of evidence will they be providing for the qualification? Okay, so they need to provide either theory, uh, both theory and practical evidence. So the theory could be written work um, and also discussions with the assessor. Practical could be um, something like a photograph of you performing a particular task or a witness testimony. So somebody giving you a testimony who's seen you performing the task. Okay, and so with regards to the employer, how does the employer support the apprentices with these apprenticeships? Okay, so the employer is uh, required to supervise and train the apprentice, um, first and foremost. They're also required to pay the minimum apprenticeship wage, at least. Um, in addition to this, all, they also need to give advice and guidance, and they're also responsible for safeguarding young learners and vulnerable learners as well. Okay, so if any of um, the employers or learners want to get any more information, how's the best way to contact you guys? Okay, you can email, email us at info at keits.co.uk or give us a call on 01923 856 584. Okay, Louise, thank you very much. Thank you.